Hey TFNAS teens and families, it's Pastor James with a quick announcement video for you. You may have heard that over the next two Sundays, October 11th and 18th, we are taking a hiatus from in-person worship services because of the rise in COVID-19 cases and hospitalizations in Twin Falls County. Uh, but we will continue to have our worship services online on Facebook and YouTube in English at 11 and uh, in Swahili at 1 o'clock on Facebook. But we are going to continue having in-person youth ministry during all of our regular times. So teen life groups on Sundays at 9 a.m., uh, high school night Sundays at 6 p.m., and midnight on Wednesdays at 7 p.m. are all going to continue during this time with one small change. You know, I've been thinking about our core values, uh, specifically our, our core values, you matter and here to serve. And those two core values aren't just for us in our youth group and in our church, it's for our entire community. There are ways that God reminds us that all the people around us matter, that they are deserving of love and care. And one of the ways that we can do that best, especially during the pandemic, is by following all of the protocols that the health department hands out to us. And so we've been doing a great job of social distancing, um, but I think that we can take one more step to love and care for people in our community, especially those who are at risk, those who have pre-existing conditions and COVID-19 could be really detrimental to them. So starting Sunday, as in tomorrow, at all youth ministry functions and programs, we are going to be requiring masks. Now, I know that we don't want to do this. Masks are not fun to wear. We like being able to see each other's faces. But I think we can all agree that if there was a way that we can love and care for someone, just even if it was just one person who benefits from all of us doing a small thing, like wearing masks, I think we would agree that is the most loving thing for us to do. And so that's what we're going to be doing from now on. So bring your masks with you. Uh, we'll also have some available when you come into the gym. Um, but let's mask up and gather together just like we have been doing, worshiping God and growing in the faith and allowing God to form us and shape us into who God wants us to be. So we look forward to seeing you at any of our youth programs, whether it's teen life groups at 9 a.m. tomorrow or high school night coming up uh, at 6 p.m. tomorrow night or midnight Wednesday, 7 o'clock. We would love to see you there in your mask. Grace and peace.